In the first half of Ephesians chapter 2, verse 10, the Apostle Paul tells us that we are God's workmanship, created in Christ Jesus. Let me ask you a question. Have you ever created something from scratch? You didn't have a kit, didn't even have instructions, didn't look it up on YouTube. You just created it. Well, I had an opportunity a number of years ago when I was sitting down to watch the Super Bowl. Now, you know how long that goes with the halftime and everything. And I said to Judy, is there anything that I need to do for you or, or build for you here at the house that I can do in front of the TV set? And she said, yeah, there is. Uh, we need a holder for the iron in the bathroom up next to our bedroom. And I knew that was true because we'd knocked it over a couple times. So I started thinking through, what do I have here at home so I don't have to go shopping? And I had some shelving, white shelving, and I cut off a couple ends and made a little wedge, and the iron would pull into that wedge, and I had little angle irons that bolted it in place. And then I thought, you know, I've watched at cleaners what they do sometimes. They'll, they'll put the cord way up high uh, so they keep it out of the way when they're ironing the clothes. I said, well, I can add that feature. And so I, I, I screwed in a little piece of PVC, and my son had broken his fly rod, and so I wedged in the cork of the handle and ran it up about half the height of the, of the fly rod originally. And, and it had these big eyes so I could run cords through it easily. And then I thought, you know, Judy uses spray starch. I think what I'll do is take a cup, cut off the handle of the cup, and bolt that in there. It was plastic. Bolt it in. And so she had a place to put her spray starch. Now, when I got done, I brought Judy up. I said, look at this. She said, wow, that's really something. And, you know, I go by it every day, and occasionally I'll pause and look at it and say, you know, I created that. That's not a proud thing. It's just an observation. In fact, Judy one time actually posted on her blog, I want to show you something my husband created. Well, you see, we are created by Christ Jesus. We're his workmanship. And when he looks down from heaven and sees us, he says, wow, that's something I did. That person is a person that I created. So be encouraged. Know that Jesus is pleased with you. And then, of course, lead your life in a way that will make him proud. <music>